what's up you guys? Connor Minecraft Gamer here. Whoa, it's bright. Doing a video on some, maybe all, of uh, the updates. Let's get creative. We're going to go ahead and get super good on here. I'm just setting up the world. Okay. Yep. It's a super flat world just to show you a lot of cool things in the new update. I showed you in the last video the elytra, but I'll show it again just because I feel like it. Why not? Yeah. I just gotta wait for this world to load now. <laughs> yeah, a super flat wall. Wow, I found a village in no time. But I don't care about that village right now. I don't care about any of that stuff in that chest because... Wait, I didn't even know this was in the game. There's dragon heads now. Oh, ha! Look at me. I look ridiculous. My head is like... Huge. So I wonder if you kill the Ender Dragon, you can actually get the Ender Dragon's head. But that's the main thing I was showing. Hold on, we need a few things. Let me get this, this, this. We also need glass and gas tears. There's a very good reason for these things. Give me that. And there's a potion of dragon's breath. I'll have to try that out. New things that are added. Lingering potions. I'm going to show you what lingering potions do. Hold on. Sorry for the camera being shaky. Hold on a minute. I've never been the person to do this kind of stuff. But for me, this mod is so... Whoa. This mod is so interesting that I have to do it. So, this fruit I'm holding... I can't pronounce the name of it, but... You can eat this in creative or survival. When you eat it, it teleports you. You can eat it in creative or survival. See, look. I had a stack. Now I have 63 pieces. It teleports you from where you were to close to where you were or far away. So you're practically an enderman. Cool. Okay, now I can throw that in my inventory. That's what that food does. See these lingering potions right here? Whenever you throw one down, it doesn't just create bubbles. No, no, no. Those bubbles do damage to you for as long as they're there. Look, I keep taking damage and damage and damage and damage. Damage. Yeah. So... These? To be honest, I don't know what those do. But those were added in this update. Now this, I don't know what this is for. It's Dragon's Breath. I'll see you guys. In okay, we're back. Sorry about that. So, another cool thing that was added in, and this will come in handy later, is End Crystals. Now you can craft and crystals. All you need is eyes of ender, glass, gas tears. Four. Four of each of those. Well, no, not four glass. But if you put eyes of ender in the middle, the gas tears. Whoa. Right there. Below the. I can't show you. Crafting recipe. There. And you surround it with uh, glass. Hold on. Whoa. Whoa. What did I do? Anyway. And you. You surround that with glass. You get. And crystals. And you only need four of those. You only need four of those. But I was just showing you how to make 
and crystals that will come in handy for this new update so now the biggest thing let's go to the end one last thing when you go to the end now you're gonna want to place down an ender chest trust me so end portal frames get out of here are directional that's how you pronounce it. Now, I need to move that ender chest. Let's place it right there. See, that ender chest is going to come in handy, so we don't want to get rid of the ender chest. End portal frames are directional. So, you need to place them all apart and like that. And so, we're going to go in. Same stuff. You know, you got to kill the ender dragon. I mean, that's normal so before we go ahead and just take out the ender dragon I got some enchantments to enchant my bow with because I want this to be quick I want this to be quick I want this to be easy quick and easy that's all I'm asking for now let's throw out that let's go ahead and go and shoot those um the things that heal him, the end crystals, I was blanking. I'll see you guys in a minute. So, now that we've took, I've, I took out all the crystals off cam, cam, camera, you know, cam. Now, I have to go and kill the ender dragon. Perfect, the ender dragon's right there, that's perfect. Let's shoot the ender dragon with my arrows this might be a while no ender dragon maybe i should just kill this guy off camera actually no i will kill him on camera what what is that purple stuff it's weird Kill the Ender Dragon. Oh, another thing. When you fire your bow, it actually shows an arrow in the the bar right right there, the bar. See? Shows an arrow. Isn't that cool? Okay. Let's get ready. Let's kill the Ender Dragon. on this in case you guys don't know this so I gotta kill the ender dragon I am going to kill him off camera because the main things don't involve the ender dragon only one does so I'll see you in a minute okay so I killed him see he's dying and he you know he does the normal stuff he drops experience he drops his egg which obviously you can pick up his egg, but that's not all that happens. No, no, no. Remember how I said you would need the ender crystals? The end crystals? Now you do. You place one there. You place one there. You place one here. This should work. And you place one there. Something happens. There's a beam, and it shoots up in the sky. Uh, um, it's replanting. See, look, it's reviving all the end crystals. See, 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 see. Look, I broke that end crystal. I broke that end crystal. I broke that end crystal. Once it revives all the end crystal, your friend, the ender dragon, comes back. And I know he's not anybody's friend, but... Yeah, so you can fight the end dragon as many times as you want in survival or creative. All you need is to craft end crystals and place them down like I did. You guys saw how I placed those down, and I'll do it again. So, that is going to have to wrap up part one 
of this. Stay tuned for part two. I'm going to record right after this. I'll see you all next time. Thank you so much for 11 subscribers, guys. You are amazing, and I'll see you all next time. Goodbye.